walking to the Penang Road, famous Teochew, it's not that far away. 400 meters, okay. six minute walk. But the problem is, it's still drizzling. So I'm wet, my camera's wet, my microphone's wet, my lens is wet, everything's wet. Are you wet? That is the stall. And usually there's obviously a line, but we're here like five minutes early and hopefully we don't have to wait. Or maybe they're open already, I don't know. Let's go find out. Okay. 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 Did you the roja the last one? Oh yes. Oh. Mm. Except oyster. Oyster. Yeah, in the middle of the fried chicken. Okay, that's all. Jack boys, yeah. Hmm. She has like a never-ending coin supply counting behind her. It's a little bit. But one thing I see in the prawn size is always like this. Mm. The food is really good, but I think we're just a bit too full because not, not like this. more than 10 minutes ago we were eating breakfast. Alright, we are done with lunch and it was good. I mean, it's everything that I was expecting, but we could not finish it at all. Don't get me wrong, the food is good, you know, the chakritya, the wok here was really nice, the asam laksa was nice. I really enjoyed the roja and of course the chendol, the iconic chendol. You can't really get it anywhere else even though they they've, they've franchised out. But yeah, the breakfast we had like just a couple minutes ago really screwed up our lunch appetite. There was so much eggs for breakfast. And you know, the fried oysters were egg, the chakwetia was egg. But we took away the food. Oh, it's still raining. We took away the food. And now we are gonna go get some jiro and then go to the hotel. Speaking of the hotel, really exciting stay at Double Tree Penang. They upgraded our room and I'm gonna share that with you guys in a bit. Hey guys, we just arrived at the hotel. By the way, sorry if the mic was noisy just now. I, I'm using a new mic and I've reduced the input gain and turned on noise cancellation. Anyway, like I said, we're at the hotel. Let me check in and show you our room. You've got two rooms on the left and on the right. Let me show you the one on the right first. On the right side, you have the toilet. Really spacious. That's a common theme for this whole family room. Spacious, so storage, wardrobe, two single beds. You have a TV, place to make drinks, mini bar. There's a sofa. And check out this view, we've got the sea view. It's, it's a pretty bright day, let me, let me make it a bit clearer for you. Yeah, there you can see it. And they've also included a small gift for us. We'll open that later. I wanted to show you the toilet first, which is similar, nice and spacious, but how can you not see the elephant in the room? This beautiful king size bed. You've got similar storage solutions on the right. Okay, so make drinks, mini bar, TV, a table. And the special thing about this room is that you have a balcony. Let me make it a bit easier on the eyes. 
So this is a very spacious balcony, complete with all the seats that you need. And of course, that beautiful, beautiful sea view. It's a really nice room. Hey guys, so it's about 4 p.m. right now and we are heading down to the beach slash night market area which is only starting around 2 to 3 hours from now. I just wanted to update you guys because I forgot to take videos about the gift that was in the room. So it turns out that was the high tea set and I'll include some pictures of it right now. The selection was good. I really like the cakes. I don't really like the savoury pastries but we obviously couldn't finish it all because it's still very full. So we're going to continue eating that a bit later. Thank you once again Double Tree Pinning for giving that for us. Okay guys, we just got dropped off by the Grab. Uh, the, the market's going to be along this road later, but obviously we're here two, three hours early, so Adriana there is getting uh, some apam balik from this store that she remembers from many, many years ago. Why? Why? Light, thin and crispy. Nice flavors, not too sweet. This is the chocolate peanut butter. Our choice whenever we go for waffles, but this apam balik form. It is good, but I think original is better. Original is best. A few moments later. I think I want to ride a horse. Forty can. Okay, uh, the horse is taking a pee break. So, ah! Wait, nampak Thank you. Uh, I think you guys got a nice view of the horse being. Oh, he is pissed off. I'm so glad I brought my camera for this. The sun is about to set and it was a bit hot just now, but this is honestly the perfect time to ride this horse. Right, we're making a turn back to where we started. Look at that. I really love the sound of the waves. It's 7.42 now and we are finally making our way to the Pasar Malam. I'm not really expecting that much, but you know, since we're here before we go back to the hotel. So we have a few stalls there and I think a little bit more at the front. It's not looking that good, honestly. There used to be a lot of stalls. You can see everything is closed right now. And further in front, you, you'll just find like one, two stalls randomly spaced out. Used to be so much more happening. These are pretty lights. I think this is the ones that we bought in Thailand, right? That is about it for the night market, the Pasar Malam. Unfortunately, most stalls are not open. There's one behind me. It's not with the lights not even on. Maybe when there's more people. But yeah, that's about it. Sorry guys, it's a bit unfortunate. <laughs> Alright guys, we are finally back in the hotel. And let me tell you, it was not as easy as you'd expect. Somehow, none of the e-hailing or taxis would pick up our request. And at one point, we had three apps running, Grab, AirAsia, my car, and no one would accept our ride for at least 30 minutes. So eventually, Grab did accept our order, and now we are back. But we are so tired. And Adriana's about to come in. My mom hit me. I said, don't bring any guys in. <laughs> so before we end today's video, I thought it would be interesting if we took a quick look at the gym in the hotel. So let me turn this camera around. I'm alone in here, so I'm free to make this video for now. We've got some machines here. It's nice to see that they actually have proper machines that you can use. Some ellipticals, treadmill, bicycles, more machines, resistant bands, benches, 
free weights, that's always good. Some other exercise stuff. Water, lockers, and a toilet. So you can see it's pretty well equipped and I think the space is alright. This is a really well equipped hotel gym because I've seen so much worse. Alright guys, that's it for this video. Sorry, sorry that the market didn't turn out as interesting as I expect. But yeah, that's it from me and I'll see you guys tomorrow where we have a very exciting tour in the forest. Bye!